Hello everyone and welcome to Full Stack Devlogs. I hope you are enjoying the videos one by one and this is the second video in the series of learning Node.js. In the last video we saw that how we have to install Node.js on our local machine and then just a simple function that we write and execute. And we executed using just saying node and the file name. That's it. And we print hello friends, I am node.js in the console. Now here in this video, we are going to look at how we can modularize our JS files. So now we see how do we separate this function into a, into a complete uh, different file and then export from there and import here, whatever we require. So for doing that, we will first create a file called, let's call it utility.js. And I will move this greeter function in here. And now I need to export it. So to export it, we use module.exports property. And in the curly braces, we just pass the name of the function. That's it, we are done exporting. Now to import, we first uh, will take this inside a variable, a const variable, and let's say name as utility itself, using the require function. We will just obtain this. And since uh, utility.js in is in the same path, as app.js, we will just say dot slash and then utility. And here, instead of directly calling greeter, we can call it like utility dot greeter. And that's it. Let's try running it now. Again with node app.js. And we see that still we have the output, the same output. So here, if we change and say and I am modular now save it and you will see that the text is updated so that's the beauty of uh, doing imports and exports and we will see in much detail how we can like create much complex exam examples out of it and how do we use it in real world scenarios if you're watching this video right now and if you think that the content on this channel is really helping you evolve, grow, learn and share something new today, please don't forget to subscribe the channel. Doing the same will ensure that you don't miss any of my future updates. Thank you for being there. Hope you enjoyed the content. See you in the next video.